National 5 biology students, let's do this extended response question together. So this one says, farmers use fertilisers with a high nitrate content to increase the yield of crops. The diagram shows two possible fates of nitrates and fertilisers, so they can be absorbed by plants or leached into locks. Describe how the leaching of nitrates can result in a reduction in the number of freshwater organisms in locks. Okay, so the first thing we need to say is that within the loch, the algal population um, increases, okay? Or you could say an algal bloom forms, okay? Because the bloom indicates that it's increasing, okay? Either one of those two points for the, the initial mark on this one. The second mark is we need to talk about the result of that. When there's an algal bloom, that will reduce the light levels because it's going to be blocking the sun from entering the water. Okay, you could also say killing aquatic plants. Okay, but you don't need to say that for the mark. That's just a, an extra little flourish to show off that you you have that knowledge. Now, because these plants are now dead. Bacteria are going to feed on these dead plants. And because the algal bloom grows very quickly but also dies very quickly, it will also feed on the dead algae as well. Okay. What will be the result of that? Well, the bacteria numbers are going to increase. Okay then. Bacteria numbers will increase because they are getting a plentiful supply of food and the bacteria use up, use up lots of O2, okay, they use up large quantities of oxygen. Or you could say bacteria reduces the oxygen available for the other organisms, but it means the same thing, okay? So use up the, the oxygen. I will just write large quantities to emphasize that they are using up so much that other organisms don't get sufficient levels of oxygen, okay? So I hope that makes sense, and I hope that's helped you answer that question. I'll see you all in the next one, folks.